pixies. Oh fuck. I think I pulled my groin doing fucking loopies. <laughs> you know what's funny is that uh, he, him leaving his blinker on and then me just busting a little Tony Carbajal stunt show in the fucking dirt over there. We're switched places today. I'm the pro stunt rider today, and Carbacunt is a little piece of shit that can't ride for dick. <laughs> Bless up, Dan Queely. Your career is not the only one that I've ruined. So today, the Link Hunt is up to his normal shenanigans. He's taking us up to some fucking world famous burger place, and I tried not to get any information uh, about the place beforehand because I'd rather talk about dicks and vaginas forever. But he made a mistake and he told me that it was uh, musically themed. And today I'm going to give you a brief history of insert title of restaurant here. So insert title of restaurant here was founded in uh, 1969 when a famous porno cameraman became a ravenous food cook of hamburgers and other delightful American signature classics. He and his girlfriend were very big fans of the pornos and they had various sex positions codenamed after famous movies. Once he got fired from the porn industry for rubbing his tip too much and getting man gravy all over the talent, he started his own hamburger joint. Like the sexual positions that him and his wife share every night, my personal favorite of his was the Titanic, where he would dip down below his wife's dress in a fancy restaurant, put a piece of iceberg lettuce up her fucking coochie, stuff it all the way down, finger deep, and then he would try to fish it out with his tongue, and then he would jack off. As in, Jack falling into the water into the icy abyss while homegirls resting on a piece of iceberg lettuce. With that regard, every single one of his menu items was named after all of them sexual positions. And so that's how the restaurant, insert restaurant title here, has become world famous. Whoa, what the fuck? Dude! Wow! <laughs> Woo! Woo! Good old delinquent. That's what all the kids like. They like them. <laughs> Wheelies. Feels like I have titties right now. Like the water bottle in my jacket, it probably looks like I have like a nice pair of jugs right now. Or like one titty. Like I lost one in Vietnam and I just have one fucking good titty. That lost titty sacrifices will not go unappreciated because it saved me. Saved my life. What the fuck are you doing, retard? Hi, baby. Damn, that firefighter was fire! Damn, I love a woman in uniform. Mmm. Mm-mm. I do declare that birthday uniform. Got his legs all kinds of stretched out. Looks like he's about to get a fucking gynecological exam right now. Dude, he's got his fucking legs up in the stirrups like he's about to fucking get a fucking fat dick pulled out of his butt. I mean, don't mistake this for hate, but that's what you look like, bud. I mean, 
You got the stirrups. That's like having a dildo and not having a girlfriend and say that you don't stick the dildo in your butt. I know, they're all fucking white. Like fucking God just shot a rope on all of them. Like Jesus fucking Christ himself shot a rope on them. Bless up. Bless up, child. Bless up. Ah. Oh. You and me, delinquent. Look at you, what a nice guy delinquent is. Everyone always says, oh, delinquent's such a meanie head. Such a doo-doo face. He's always so mean to Z. Look at him. Waiting for your boy. Derek is so far away that not even in the fucking mic zone anymore. Not even on the Santa zone. So for all you little dickhead who want to call the link kind of dickhead, you're the dickhead. You are the ones who are the ball lickers. Because the link hunt's a nice guy. All right. I don't want to hear no more shenanigans from you guys. All right. Oh yeah, girl. Go ahead and bend that ass over. Let me see. Are you fine? You might be fine. Nope. Nope, nope, you're like 80. But you probably got a rockin' bob though inside the uh, the silly putty you probably got going on. Man, I'm really shit talking that lady. It's unnecessary. Mm. Ah, got my bad mushrooms! Ah, got my bad mushrooms! Oh my god, he on X Games mode. Finger in your fucking arm cooter. I had the time of my life and I never felt this way before. Yes, I swear this is true and I owe it all to you. All right, buddy. All right. Oh my God. Ah! <laughs> oh. Yep. Watch, watch your head. Oh, my camera. Okay. Man. Carbacon almost just took a fucking dive right now. It's because I tried to pull a Tyquasia up in the fucking thingy. And I tried to take both seats and try to get him to sit on my lap. That was my ploy. Pretty romantic. Carbacon just tried to go in for a kiss right now. And then I, and then I killed the romance with my... Uh, I had a vision of a vagina in my head and I was like wait a minute this ain't right ah! hydraulics buddy how do you break the sound barrier damn baby legs is right on your heels is it is it allowed if I use my foot <laughs> all right breaking the sound barrier breaking the sound barrier Oh my god, oh, almost fell over. I'm making sure that I always have the brake, the gas on at all times. Gas on. Not slowing down. Oh, fuck. Oh, my god. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Never mind. Never the fuck mind. Oh my god. Yeah, like coming. I think it was the first couple of turns where it was sketched out. Now I'm, I'm going full throttle the whole way. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, this is a challenge right here. Not allowed. <laughs> what are you chickening out? All right, full throttle. Oh, I almost got the stick up my butt. Did you just do a freestyle rap? Okay. All right, there's nothing. Full throttle. Full throttle. Oh shit, I kicked it. No brakes. No brakes.
No breaking. Oh fuck. Oh no. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god, bro. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I totally ate it. <laughs>